Let's talk about the NOT gate. The NOT gate. I go to Multimedia Logic, my application program. I'm going to draw a NOT circuit, an inverter circuit. A NOT gate is also referred to as an inverter gate or an inverter circuit. All right, <coughs> let's draw one. So I click on Draw, and I go down to an output device. I want an LED so I can see what I'm doing, see if it's working or not, and I click, and there it goes. <coughs> Next thing I want to do is go to draw an input device. I'm going to need a switch to turn everything on. So I'll put a switch right there. Now right in the middle, I'm going to want a uh, control device called an invert gate. An invert gate. I'll put that right here. And that's a not gate or an invert gate. Now, my mouse is now an invert gate making machine. I have to turn it back into a into regular arrow mode. So I go to Draw and Selector. And now it's a regular arrow again. Otherwise, every time I'd click, I'd get another one of these items that I just selected off of the menu, the Draw menu. All right, so I move this over to here, about there. Now let me position this here. That's nice. Now i got to wire them together wire them together. Let me move that a bit that way. Yeah, that's nice. Let's wire them together. Draw, wire. So I move the uh, mouse right to the edge of the little knob right here. Click and drag over to here. Let go and bada bing, it's done. Again, bada boom, it's done. And selector. There we go. So bada bing, bada bang, Bada boom. And there's our circuit. Let's talk about this circuit. <clears throat> right now, our switch is turned off. Turned off means zero. Turned off means zero. So I have a zero on this line going to the inverter gate, to the not gate. Zero. I have a zero on this line. Hmm. If there's a zero on this line and it hits the inverter, it will become a one here and turn this on. It isn't on right now because I'm not in simulator mode. I'm just talking theoretically what will happen. When I switch this switch to a one, a one will come across this line. When I turn it on, the on, the, symbolized by the number one, the one comes across here, hits the inverter gate, is turned into a, its opposite state, a zero, and the zero will turn this off. Hmm. So whatever is on this line, zero or a one, on or off, will get switched to its opposite on this line. Who does the switching? This guy does. He turns ones into zeros and zeros into ones. That's his job. He's the inverter gate. He's the not gate. I get a one. What's not one? Not one is a zero. I get a zero over here. What's not zero? A one. That's why it's called a not gate. Also known as an inverter gate. Okay, enough talking. Let's do it. I go to simulate, click on simulate, and click on run. <coughs> Immediately, the light turns on. Why? There must be a 1 across here. Invert, there must be a 0 here. And ooh la la, what do we see? We've got a 0 here. 0 switches off. There's a 0 state here, inverted to a 1. There's now a 1 here, and the light goes on. Remember, 0 is off, 1 is on. 0 is off, 1 is on. <coughs> Currently, there's a zero here. Get switched to a one on. Off, inverter gate on. Light goes on. Let me switch states and turn the switch on. <coughs> Watch what happens to the LED. It goes off. Why? Because on state, a one, hits the inverter gate, gets changed to a zero, and zero, off state, shuts off 
the LED. Shuts off the LED. Turn it off, the LED goes on. Turn it, the switch on, the LED goes off. Why? Because of the inverter gate switching the ones to a zeros and zeros to a one. Ons to offs and offs to ons. That's the job of the inverter gate. Whatever you tell it to do, it does the opposite. Wow. That is the NOT gate. Well, thanks for watching, and so long now, from Gary D777, also known as Hoboken Gare.